how to remove Express Checkout in Shopify in 2024. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. I hope you all are doing great and are having an amazing and absolutely incredible day. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you how you can remove Express Checkout in your Shopify store in the easiest and most simplest way possible. So to do this, what you're gonna do is you're gonna come over to your online store, okay? And uh, once you go to your online store from here, what you're gonna to wanna to do is you're gonna to go to your online store's code editor, okay? And once you obviously go into your code editor from there, what you're gonna to wanna to do is uh, you can get a general idea of uh, how you know you can actually edit your store through code. Now, the store's code editor gives us a really good idea of how we're gonna to want to, you know, keep our preferences, keep our differences between the stores and all, right? Now, if you wanna go ahead and keep a theme for the online store, you can do that as well. So, you know, just get any custom theme. Now, most people actually go ahead and use the Dawn theme for themselves. So let's say I'm gonna go ahead with the Dawn theme. So what that does is uh, it brings you to the current occurring section, okay? And from here, you're gonna go to edit code. Now, once you come to edit code, from here, you're gonna want to follow a few steps. Now, if you don't know how to code, do not worry. Just follow these simple steps, okay? I'm gonna lead you through and help you with all the simplistic ways you can complete these steps for yourself. So I'm just gonna load this in for myself, okay? And as it loads in, let me explain to you the easiest way on how you can do this. Now, once the edit code section opens up, what you're gonna do from here is you are gonna go to your sections, okay? And once you go to your sections, you're gonna find main cart footer liquid. So this is main cart footer liquid. And once you go into main cart footer liquid, you're gonna go around line 82, somewhere around that, okay? So this is gonna be line 82. You're gonna find if additional checkout buttons, okay? So yeah, there we go. So if additional checkout buttons, you're gonna simply remove this till the division, okay? Don't remove the end case or anything like that. So you're gonna remove that. And if it does issues, you can also remove the end if, okay? Just remove this, there we go. So yeah, once you do this, you're simply gonna click on save and that will basically go ahead and remove your express checkout for you in the easiest way. So yeah, that is pretty much the basic idea of how we're gonna do this. So thank you for watching all the way till the end and I will see all of you in the next video. Goodbye.